And welcome into sports, everybody. Well, the final record, no good at all. In fact, the last time an OSU basketball team lost more games in a season than this one, 1972. But as they have all year long, tonight Mike Boynton's team battled to the very end. The future is bright for this head coach. His Cowboys taking on TCU. Horn Frogs would lead this thing by 21 points with just 16 minutes to go. But these pokes just would not quit. Freshman Yor Ane, just incredible tonight. 17 points, 10 rebounds, 7 blocks. He was dominant on both ends as OSU goes on a 16-0 run, and they actually take the lead with 27 seconds to go. But the Horn Frogs respond immediately. Desmond Bain there for three in the lead. Lindy Waters now 17.7 assists. His final shot, though, going long. TCU holds on to win 73-70. Final record for the Pokes this year, 12 and 20. It's disappointing to really not play the first half like we wanted to. You know, we came out there really flat line. And, you know, I felt like for, I mean, 10 minutes, we was the better team. But, you know, playing in this league, you can't win just being good for 10 minutes. We're never going to uh, let it down to anybody. I mean, this group of guys is very resilient. And, uh, you know, I'm proud to be a part of their team. You know, just, we just didn't go our way. One and done on the defensive glass. Alex Robinson. Top 20 recruiting class on the way next year. The eyes of the NFL world on Norman, Oklahoma today. Jacob Toby was there for Kyler Murray's Pro Day, and by all accounts, the Sooners Heisman winner passed the test. OU's Pro Day, or you could call it Kyler Murray's Day. He didn't run the 40 or do any agility drills. His height wasn't measured, just his weight. Murray, 205. Over 100 media members were credentialed for the event. And with so many people in the room, when Murray threw, the echo rang true. It's different being in the indoor with, you know, like you said, 400 people in there. But yeah, it's pre it pretty quiet. But uh, you know, I, I really didn't see them. You know, Murray went 61 of 67 with one drop on his passes. Both him and Lincoln Riley impressed with the performance. It was a very, very, very strong performance. I mean, no, no question about it. You go travel any pro day anywhere you want to, you're not going to see another throwing performance like that. I feel like I can throw every, every, you know, make every throw on the field. Um, I think the film shows that. Obviously, it's a little different when, you know, the GM or the coach is sitting on the sideline watching. I, mean, I looked forward to today. I mean, it was kind of, um, you know, anxious, waiting on the day to come. I mean, like I said, everybody's kind of like, yeah, you're going to go number one or all this stuff, but I don't, I'm not setting any expectations as far as that goes. Uh, wherever I go, I go. In Norman. Jacob, thank you much. Back with Thunder Highlights after this. Cast. Russell Westbrook, happy to be anywhere but Utah. Back home tonight is the Thunder host the Nets. Brooklyn led by 10 at the half, but Russ leading the comeback. Fourth quarter, you saw the alley-oop for Steven Adams. Now setting up Jeremy Grant for three, and moments later, shot clock winding down. Russ is going to collect the loose ball. And here's your dagger, 31 points, 12 rebounds, 11 assists. He was great. Thunder gets the win, 108-96. Dancing. Visit Indiana tomorrow night. Joe Oklahoma Ford Sports Report. We'll be right back.